Welcome back to the Sports Zone. Who doesn't like to bowl? I do. The young lady next to me obviously does. Deandra as Beatty. 2009 team trials for USA in town, and you're a 10-time Team USA member. Uh, just talk about the trials coming into town. Yeah, sure. We are at Sunset Station. Yeah. We're bowling all week from 9 a.m. Please come on out. You're yeah. going to see some of the best bowlers ever at this tournament. There's professional, there's the best amateur, and we're all vying for five spots. Yeah, five men, five women have already been selected, and as you said, uh, ten more men and five men, five women will be selected uh, after these team trials. That's right. It's going to yeah. be a really grueling week. There's uh, nine games each day, so I don't know how many games you've bowled in. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we know. Don't act like we were talking earlier uh, before we started the interview, and I was telling her about I rolled a 202, and you're laughing at my form yeah. already, right? Kevin, Not Kevin good. we need to go bowling, because <laughs> right, exactly. you have a couple things that yes. you need to learn. Yes. First of all, it's not these fingers. Yeah, right. It's these fingers. Right. There you go. For <laughs> starters, yeah, I'm pathetic. I understand that. Yeah, but uh, but uh, ten-time uh, Team USA member. Uh, that, that's got to be. That's incredible to represent your country. Bowling has literally taken me around the world. I yeah. have bowled in some crazy places that I would have never traveled to had it not been for, for bowling. Mm -hmm. I got a full ride scholarship to University of Nebraska. There's so much great scholarship money out there for youth bowlers, and because of all the opportunities there is in bowling, yeah. that's why I stayed in it. For so long and that's why all those kids out there watching this yeah they need to realize that there are so many different levels of bowling and it can literally take you around the world and a couple of junior bowlers this week are going to have uh, their birth onto the junior team USA right. and they're going to be able to travel around the world so bowling has really been good to me there's a, there's a lot that people don't realize yeah. uh, about our sport and and it's a lot tougher than people think yeah, as right. you know yeah, yeah exactly as we, we were don't talk, use bumpers. Yeah, exactly as we were talking about it again you were laughing at me because we were talking about the weight of the balls and other, other various issues but you come from a, a bowling family uh, your sister also here trying to make a Team USA? Yes, my sister Cassie and mm -hmm. I were on the team a couple of years um, and she was my role model growing up. She's mm -hmm. three years older than I am and really a big reason why I wanted to stay in bowling because she won everything before I did and I was like, well, I want to <laughs> win it too and yeah. you know, we've had a chance to travel around the world together so I think that's pretty cool. And uh, when you talk about bowling, obviously here uh, everybody talks about Wendy McPherson and she is a member of the uh, 2009 Team USA and she also is a role model for you. Yes, Wendy McPherson and I just roomed together in uh, a Team USA event and Chile, mm -hmm. definitely a big bowling idol uh, for me growing up. I used to watch her bowl on TV and think, wow, I want to be a bowler. You know, bowler of the decade of the 90s. She's, yeah. she's really amazing, and I'm just, I'm, it's an honor to be her friend, let alone teammate. Yeah, and uh, you go to, uh, Deandra has a really interesting website. Uh, D talk about your website and, and a clothing line, and you just go ahead and run with that. And, yes. uh, and it's really, I was checking it out earlier, mm -hmm. some interesting stuff on there. Check it out, DeandraBowling.com. Mm -hmm. You can learn a little bit about me, about bowling, yep. about the United States Bowling Congress, which is running this tournament. And really, this tournament is a start of some really great tournaments to come. We have the USBC. To the Las Vegas, right? Yes, yeah. USBC Masters is mm -hmm. going to be here, the USBC uh, Championships, which runs for months. We're setting up 60 lanes at the Cashman Center and uh, it's really going to, there's going to be a lot of bowlers in Las yeah. Vegas. I don't know if you're going to be able to handle it, but <laughs> yeah. DeandraBowling.com and also I have a clothing line mm -hmm. I started a couple years ago because I don't know if you know this or not, but <laughs> Bowlers don't have the greatest fashion sense, so I wanted to change and, yeah. um, and make that a little bit better. Kaizen by Deandra, K-A-I-Z-E-N by mm -hmm. Deandra.com. You can find that on Deandra Bowling as well. But Perfect. Yeah, Perfect. And uh, so we went through an entire bowling interview. I did not mention beer, and oh, I did not mention kingpin. Did. You just did. Oh, wait, I just did. I, I blew know. it. I was doing so okay. good. Well, well, I had to, right? <laughs> Everybody would uh, be asking me what was going on. I know. Well, I'm just going to mention Anchorman. There you so, go. Exactly. Anything. Perfect. Okay. You can catch uh, Deandra, her sister, and a whole bunch of other uh, professionals. Bowls, which professional bowlers now, uh, as of last year, can compete in Team USA trials, Yeah, right? for nine years yeah. I was on the team. It was only amateur. Last right. year was the first year that professionals are allowed to be on our team, mm -hmm. and it makes it a lot more difficult to make the team now. No doubt about it. Okay, again, that's at Sunset Station uh, for the next four days, and uh, it all started out today, actually, so three more days, and uh, go check it out. Some yeah. of the best bowlers uh, in the world. Are you going to come out for some uh, you, you bet I am. I'm going <laughs> to let you laugh at me some more. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Deandra. Thank Appreciate you. It. Okay.